we've been asking him to do. Coach Mo, speaking of guys taking their steps in the right way, uh, Tony Mitchell is an in-state guy, very highly touted, a guy that came in with some early problems but has turned it around. What has he been bringing to the practice and how are you evaluating right now and where does he stand? You know, I think Tony's like a lot of the guys right now. The information's been new. Um, even some of the veteran guys, just because the newness of scheme and newness of staff, um, you can lean on veteran experience, but the calls are still new to you like the other guys. So I think there's a learning curve that's continued to take place with him. Um, the biggest thing that stuck out to me more than anything is I think there's a tight-knit group that is hungry and they want to work. I think there's a good core and a, good, a great foundation of guys that, that want to do it the right way. And um, so we're just trying to give them the opportunity to prove what they need to prove, put them in advantageous situations, and let the film decide really ultimately who does what. So a lot of coaching is, you know, you get the guys lined up with the the players in terms of what they do and the consistency of what they do, they ultimately decide and they tell the story of who's going to do what. And uh, so we're, we're continuing on that process and uh, we're going to continue to put these days together. Hey coach, as, with your background as a recruiter and a former head coach, what are your thoughts on like the possibility of a June signing day? I think um, there's so many moving pieces involved. When you think, you know, I was on the AFCA Board of Trustees, there's a lot of back and forth. It's like anything in industry when you make shifting changes there's advantages and then there's ultimate also built-in disadvantages. Uh, you try to have as much foresight as possible to anticipate what are the good and what are some of the negatives that can come out of it. We don't know all of them. Some of them you can anticipate, some of them you don't know. But ultimately, what are we trying to do? We're trying to grow our sport in a healthy way and do what's in the best interest of college football and what's in the best interest of the student athlete. Um, so uh, I think there's a lot of pieces and a lot of decisions that have to be made. And like anything else in industry and business, whatever those final decisions are, we'll, we got to stay ahead of the curve and be ready to swiftly make changes if, if that's what's necessary. Speaking of recruiting, speaking. you look at recruiting and doing the videos out here in the practice, it seems like there's a pretty received pretty well from the recruits. I think you can't talk about certain recruits. But yeah, I, I think we're always trying to find ways to connect, always trying to find ways to make guys feel like that they are a priority. And, um, you know, there's a lot of things that can make you successful in recruiting. Um, you know, we've we've had a lot of success you know, throughout the years. I think our staff and this program, obviously, has been, a, has been a model, has been a standard of success. But really, the core of it, what are you trying to do? You're trying to genuinely connect with people. You're trying to, uh, you know, there's a process process of identification. There's a process of recruitment. I think now in the NIL age, there's a process of retaining those talented players. And then there's the development and the growth and then putting those guys in a situation where they can go out there and be successful. But we're going to find every single way that we can connect and have some fun with it. I think it's been a, a, a really, uh, it's been received very well from a lot of guys. I think one of the recruits posted it there and it made social media news. And, and uh, I, th I think we've seen some, some people even try to copy it a little bit. So it means we're doing it the right way, I guess. All right, Coach Mo, thank you. Thanks a lot, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.